what's up everyone welcome back to my channel i'm gonna be doing a little vlog for you guys i want to go record a video for the trippy cat channel right now so i'm hella lit and my mom bought these like sparkling jose i don't know i'm not to show you guys what she bought but you already know if you guys are ready for this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below i don't really know i'm probably gonna include something else in this video so you already know stay tuned <laughs> All right, so these are the Jose Cuervo Margaritas. They sound really good. Okay, so I put chamoy and tajin on the rim. And then I put ice. And now I'm going to pour this little thing. It tastes a little sweet. It tastes like, um, whoa, look at how pink it is. Mm. The chamoy tahini is hell bomb. Well Alright, let me try it. Cheers. I think if I didn't have chamoy and tahin, I wouldn't be able to drink it. But because I'm able to mix all of it up, it tastes bomb. You want to try it? It looks really good. It's so good. What do you think? It's sweet, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it's sweet. Yeah, the chamoy and tahin makes it mm -hmm. hella good. It tastes like candy. Yeah. Good job, baby. Numbers. What the heck are you doing? But yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this. Probably eat some of these lays. Can you get me a bowl? <laughs> Ugly. Yes, these are bomb. Those are hella good. My dream. And then if you want, you could add the patio, but I'm gonna see what that now. Finishing off my vlog, I think the last time we saw each other, I was trying out the Jose Cuervo drinks and let me update you guys on that because I don't think I did update you guys those suck uh, it says that each bottle was like 8% alcohol which is kind of like a beer and I'm a lightweight so I can't even drink a lot to begin with so I'll usually get drunk off of like two three beers I'm already like buzzing I'm like okay I'm good and I had three of those drinks and I just didn't feel no buzz like if anything it made my stomach hurt more it was really really sweet and i kept having to drink it with the chamoy and the, the tajin and it was just like too much so not a good choice but my mom is making pozole today uh, my sister ashley's here selena's here trippy's about to be here he went to the store and yeah we're just gonna be chilling hopefully we'll play some games i don't know honestly we're like super bored but Luckily, I have my family, so you already know if you guys are ready for this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you guys are new, and let me know what you guys are doing during the quarantine. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Andrew Pee Pee. Andrew Pee Pee? Yeah. How old are you? Pee Pee Dree. Come on, let's go. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I know I look crazy. It is one, oh, it's actually 12 o'clock, and I have a special delivery <laughs> that I'm so happy and so excited and so grateful for. So shout out to Portos because if you guys watched my LA vlogs or if you guys were following us and you guys were like had me on Instagram and stuff, you guys seen that I was going literally every day to get these potato balls and 
they sent us some for quarantine. <laughs> so we're about to go pick them up because I just got the email that it's at the P.O. box. So if you guys are wondering what the P.O. box is, if you guys want to send us any letters, any anything you guys want, um, this is the P.O. box. We appreciate anything that you guys send us. And you guys were telling me that you guys wanted to get like little hauls whenever we get stuff because whenever we get stuff in our p.o box we never record it <laughs> we literally just open it at home and never record it so i'm gonna record it i have to go to the post office right now and hopefully there's not a lot of people because everyone's like standing hella far away from each other right now so i'm just like hoping i can get in and get out but we'll see with the potato balls we got two dozen so this is the first box I'm probably gonna make like, you're probably gonna eat two, you're probably gonna eat two, I'm probably gonna eat two. I don't know. Probably make like six. What do you think? Are you excited? These, yeah. This is what they look like. They're frozen. And it comes with instructions. So all we have to do is preheat the oven to 350. Takes about 20 to 30 minutes. And that's what they look like. All right, you guys. So I got them in the. Oh, they're in the oven now. Twenty to thirty minutes. Twenty to thirty minutes. So we're gonna wait until golden brown. Until golden brown. All right. They just came out the oven and they cooled down for like fifteen minutes. So now comes the taste test. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for everyone to try it because I know they're gonna I'm like excited. it. I know they're good. I know. All right, we're all gonna try it on the count of three. So there's the one? Yeah, she has one. Ready? One, two, three. Everyone take a bite. Why are you just looking at her? Wow. <laughs> what do you think? Okay. Try it. What do you think? It's good. Bomb or what? You like it, mom? Right. Like they have a I don't like it. You don't like it? I want, I want the hamburger. <laughs> I, want, I want the spicy chicken. <laughs> I told you it's a potato bomb. Mm. You told me it's not. It, it's yucky. Oh good. Mm. Mm. So bomb. Um, you can get another one. Please, Andrew, since you don't want his. What's up everyone, welcome back to my channel. So the last stop, um, the last you saw me, we were, we had gotten the potato balls from Porto's Bakery and I had my family try them. So after we had tried them, I told them to rate the potato balls in one to 10. I didn't end up recording that because I felt like they were gonna be fake if I had the camera on. So I was like, let me ask you guys off camera. And no one gave it a 10. Like my mom gave it like a, an eight and my brother gave it like a seven and i don't know i was just i was surprised honestly because i gave it a 10 out of 10 i love the potato balls those are my favorite and so today my mom was like i'm gonna try to make the potato balls like i can make them so i was like okay girl so right now she's already getting started i'm about to go take you guys to the kitchen and show you guys my mom likes to cook with the music on so i might have to do a montage i'm not sure i might have her just like talk a little bit and then we'll see but you already know give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and let's go to the kitchen now we got mama cat making the potato balls so how did you make the ground beef see but that's my secret that's your secret? Yes, I'm, I'm working to see which ones are better, right? Yeah, I want to see because honestly, yeah, I feel they're like... They're kind of hard to make. They're not that easy. I've never made these before. I feel like it's all going to have to be in the filling because that's what I really like in the potato balls. So if you can get that down or even better, <laughs> oh that would be crazy. So we'll see. But yeah, you said they're hard? Yeah, they're kind of hard to make. What's the hardest part? I think trying to fill them in and make sure that they're all completely filled in with the potato. And then breading it. So Shirley has a couple made. Damn. Oh. Yeah, we'll have to see the taste test. Oh my gosh. Well, if y'all don't like it, don't talk shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see. All right, you guys. 
So Mama Cat has made the potato balls. I wish I could, um, I wish I had the, like the actual potato balls to show you guys, but, um, right now she's making ribs and she has veggies and that's all in the freezer right now. And yeah, so I didn't want to do all that. I mean, I wasn't able, to, I basically, I didn't have space in the oven to do it. So I had to wait and she was like, why don't you just try these? And I've been eating potato balls all day yesterday. So I already know what they taste like. So I'm gonna see what these are. Um, Trippy said that they look like biscuits and they kind of do, but let's see. Okay, I haven't gotten any of the meat yet. It's potato right now. What you think, babe? Be honest. <laughs> okay. Now eat a little bit more. Yeah? They kind of taste like the potato balls, but let me try the other one. What did you say? <laughs> it's a lot of potato. Mmm. It's good potato. Yeah. Mm hmm My mom makes really good mashed potatoes, so. It's like fresh, yeah. Her potato seems really good. The meat is on point. I haven't got to the meat yet. Um, but I like the I like the outside. The it's only thing is that my mom uses ground turkey and I can tell her like taste it. <laughs> like I know what ground turkey tastes like. Mm. And they use ground beef, so I'm I think. Okay. That's just like the only difference that I taste, but it doesn't kill it or anything. Like I still think it's really good. Yeah. I give it a eight out of ten because I still love the potato balls. Mm -hmm. I don't know something about it is just so good. I think it's like their flavor of their meat and like the way it just tastes together it just tastes so good. How about to get off? And, and it's like kind of falling apart now. And the potato balls don't fall apart. I'm getting on here now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It was good, Mom and Cat. Thank you. It kind of tastes like the, the meat. It has the same type of It does when you eat the peppers. But then when you bite it, you taste the chicken. Yeah. What do you think? I like it. Like it? Mm hmm Good job. Bowling or not? Yes. We got ribs, some cauliflower, some broccoli, some carrots, some Brussels sprouts, some mashed potatoes, some French bread. You Selena made you put lemon in all beers? I no, want to fresh corona. It's like corona. It's lit. Got the hot sauce. We're about to go in. Waiting for Trippy. Where's my brother? Where's and my we're brother? waiting for Ryan. All right, you guys. So I wanted to come on and just thank you guys for watching this video. I forgot to film an outro for that video, but thank you guys so much. I know the clips were kind of old, but I had clips that I just hadn't posted yet. So I edited it and I was like, oh, this is actually a good vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below if you guys have ever tried Porto's um, potato balls. Because, yo, if you haven't, you're missing out. But they actually have a Porto's at home, which is how you can order online. So if you did want to try them, you can get it mailed directly to your house, which is really nice. So you can be able to try the potato balls. Let me know if you guys end up trying them or if you've tried them before or if you like anything else from there, let me know so I can be able to try it next time I go. But thank you guys again for watching. I appreciate you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next one.